everybody, it's the Snail Mail, and I'm back with you, uh, doing another review video. And, um, this is sort of requested, sort of, I, I did one on another person in the Discord, and these two, you can't, you can't do one without the other, and if the, if Phil had a, um, a YouTube, I'm not sure if he does, I would do his as well. But, um, yeah, so, I'm gonna go review the channel, Fable. She's a friend from Discord as well. Um... She's only got so many subscribers, but dang it, that does not matter. But uh, I like the, she did her own banner art. She did, uh, actually she does all her own art because she's an art channel. Duh. But uh, yeah, so she actually suggested some ones to review. So hold on, sorry about this everybody, I just got to fiddle through my phone here okay okay oh we'll see I see okay so she's got only got eight videos so far one two three four oh no eh. there we go and uh, this is one of the ones that she asked me to watch for her so this is what's gonna happen I'm gonna watch this one alrighty Hello sunshines, it's Faye here, and today I'm going to do a very quick eye coloring tutorial. Oops, oops, oh no, oh no, I still clicked away. Hello sunshines, it's Faye here, and today I'm going to do a very quick eye coloring tutorial. Yeah. So you may. So first off, first thing I'm going to say is like, like I wish I had some sort of a voice, because she's got such a sing-song voice that's perfect for YouTube, just my god. Like first right off the bat, that voice is perfect for YouTube, especially with the the anime style drawing right here. Kind of just perk, uh, perk, perfect. So yeah, let's just continue. Here. You've seen this picture, and this is basically going to be the end result for what we're doing today. The first thing that you want to do is have your colors ready. You want a dark, a medium, and a light, and also a white. As you can see, it's dark but not too heavily saturated. A lot of things that artists uh, make a mistake if you're kind of newer is make colors too saturated, so make sure the saturation is not that high. So she's not wasting any time, she just gets straight into the, the details of the information. Um, that's pretty good. Um, for me, I'm 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 more like uh uh uh. So yeah, that's another point in your favor. Yeah, that's two points. Two points. Fable. No points. Snail. <laughs> All right. Of course, today is going to be blue, but you can do any color on the coloring wheel, and you can even mix and match colors, even though these are all kind of a blue variant. All right, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take my pen tool, and I'm going to have a layer that's lower than um, the actual line art, and I'm just going to color in the full part of the eye with the pen tool. Just color it in, and you don't need to be too careful, because you can always clean it up later with the eraser tool, which is what I will do. All right, next thing that I'm doing is I'm grabbing the darkest color and I'm going to use the coloring tool and I'm going to color a line on top of it. The reason I use the color... Uh, she makes me feel so bad at art right now. Oh. Uh, oh, uh, I feel so bad right now that, like, this looks pretty easy. She makes this look easy and it's not easy. Not for me anyway coloring tool and not the pen tool with this one is because the pen tool is too harsh whereas the coloring tool really fades nicely into the color and doesn't create such a harsh contrast so it doesn't look like the eyelid is too heavy on the eye. You don't want the eyelid to be too heavy that'll give them stoner eyes. You just want a line and sort of arched you want to keep it arched to the same shape of the eye and then you just want to draw the pupil in the middle of the eye if your character is as opposed to you know like way out there like put put the eye right over here maybe make them look crazy put it over here put it way over here you know too much space looking elsewhere you'll move this this is just a straight on eye um, for simplicity's sake <laughs> even though you are using the coloring tool you still want the deepest part of the eye to be the darkest and so you can kind of create a little bit of a fade alright that's enough of that video clearly her audio is like a hundred times better than mine <sighs> so that's I'm just going to stop counting because it's like five fable and like zero snail. So I'm going to just go cry in a corner now. No problem. Okay. 
Okay, let's see. Let's see what other she's, what other she's got on the channel. Back. Okay. Speed paint. Okay. Hello, sunshines. It's Faye here. And today I actually received a new Wacom tablet. Consistency in videos. Hello! Although, you know, I sound kind of like a depressed Mrs. Doubtfire if I tried to do that. Tablet? So I decided that I would sort of record my descent into madness. For your pleasure, of course. So I was experimenting a little bit and it wasn't really working out. So I thought I would record and share this with you as I try to figure out using my new tablet. So the actual drawing... With only eight videos, you should probably try to record more stuff. I'm just saying. So point, point me, because I have like 200 videos. But the sketch part wasn't that difficult, only because it can be messy and doesn't have to be perfect and precise, but when we actually get to the actual drawing of the line art part, it becomes much more frustrating for me. <laughs> Alright, so as you can see... You think you're frustrated. I'm frustrated just watching this so much better than me. I don't want to, I don't want to sit through tutorials that I wouldn't even be able to, like, uh, <laughs> all right, I'm just gonna just gonna power through. Drawing curves or circles, especially, is very difficult with the tablet because, well, your hand hardly draws a perfect circle as it is, so <laughs> you just sort of do your best. I normally, when I draw, use a. Everyone I know except uh, Cancer Crew is better at art than me. This is sad. It's very sad for pen but later I realized that you sort of want to go with a larger pen because the tablet makes the lines a lot thinner than the mouse does of course <laughs> why yeah so it still looks like a sketch instead of um, an actual finished piece of art that I'm ready to color um, so it's really just unacceptable at this point as far as line art goes very messy very not cute this is me trying to erase with the actual uh, tablet and that was a no-go. It is not as precise at all as a pen, so I definitely still use a pen for that. <laughs> yeah, and I just, it's gone. So you can see I moved to 10. That's what I use. Now, the curl is very frustrating. Beto's curl is the bane of my existence. <laughs> uh. So as you can see, it still it looks messy. Alrighty. It's not clean. It's not pretty. Yeah, so basically overall though, I'm like, I'm gonna watch one more just for the sake of three, you know. Um, but yeah, overall, like, I think you should make more of these obviously because they are quite informative actually. I mean, I don't use a drawing tablet, but if I did, I'd probably use these tutorials. Like, because they'd help a lot when it comes to actually doing the computerized version of drawing. Because, yeah. I'm I'm a pen and paper kind of guy. Well, pencil and paper, you know. But uh, yeah, let's let's watch a speed paint. There's probably not much talking in that, but oh well. Hello, sunshines. It's Faye here. Again, consistency in videos. That's that's a very good thing that she's got going for her. And today I'm doing a speed paint of Dapper Rowlet. I hope you enjoy it. <coughs> Just kind of gonna, you know, you can't see it, but I'm, I'm just grooving out to the music in the background here. Gotta let it load now. Mm -hmm. And that's the, that's the finished drawing. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this speed paint. This is the completed piece of art. For more art similar to this, please watch me on my Deviant Art says JJ or follow my Tumblr says JJ. If you enjoyed this speed paint, more speed paints are to come available on. There you go, Faye. You got to plug yourself in my video.
<laughs> that didn't sound right, I'm sorry. Oh. <laughs> um, I meant like, you know, she got to like, say her, uh, her stuff. Uh, but yeah, she's only got six subs and eight vids, but um, she prob she'll probably do more vids, you know, as and, like as the years go on. How long ago was this? Actually, it wasn't that long ago, so you know, um, that's actually not bad. So yeah, she's only got six subs, which is horribly unjust. So you know, go to her channel, check it out if you want to learn to to draw. She's she, she'll help you. She's also got some interesting speed paints, you know. Alrighty, I think that's that'll be it for this review. I'm the snail mail. Maybe I can get Faye to make me some banner art, because I still use this generic picture of Tokyo, I think it is. I'm not sure. But yeah. Alrighty. So that was Fable right there. Go sub her. She's awesome. And yeah. Have a good one.